What's up guys, Mike Gibbs here. Today I'm going to talk about the reed valve, specifically how it operates, to clear up some mystery with that. So the way it works is, your bike's sucking air in through your filter and intake and your carburetor. It comes through here, but the way it's getting that vacuum drawn on it is the piston going up towards TDC. So while that's happening, at the same time, you're producing compression about to make ignition to make a power stroke. So while that's all happening, you're pulling in here and it's sucking fuel and air in in the bottom as it's also getting ready to make power at the same time. As soon as this fires and starts going down, everything you just sucked in here is now going to be compressed this way as the piston comes down. So to keep it from backfiring and blowing out your air filter and everything, what this is, is essentially a check valve. It's usually made of like fiberglass or carbon fiber reeds, right? And so anyway, to keep it from blowing all that out, when the piston's going down now, this shuts so it doesn't blow all that fuel and everything back through here. And at the same time it's doing that, now it's, compre it's created compression in the crankcase. And just for a visual, then you got your little portholes right here. And as this comes down at a high velocity, creating the crank pressure, it's going to force all that fuel and air mix up through these ports, up into the top of the head. So this is going down, and you're also getting your exhaust fire at the same time as soon as this piston passes the port to your exhaust and it's just going to let it out and then it just starts all the way over again so now your piston's down all your fuel and air has went to the top and then it's going to come back up compress and fire again and at the same exact time it's going to, it's going to be pulling in fuel and air and it just keeps doing that and that's how a two-stroke operates but if you've been curious what a reed valve is actually doing it's just keeping it's regulating air this is basically an air compressor but it's keeping it from blowing back this way so to really simplify it you have an air pump that's that's really all any combustion engine is is an air pump and this makes it to where it can only pull air this way and force it out this side and nothing can go back this way and that's that's what that's doing so it's a check valve uh, if that was useful please let me know comment on it maybe drop a like so I can know if I'm doing a good job or not and uh, work on my content appreciate it have a good day bye bye